And now it's the part of the show that you've all been waiting for. It's Tom's last teenage blast on February 11th, 1989. This is the audio portion of that final teenage blast that Joe and I had. Well, it was my last teenage blast. And when um, we went to Elizabeth so I could drink for the last time in my teen years. And by golly, Joe was there to help me. Okay, here it is. I trust Joe to, you know, really give me a, a, a fun evening. You know, I can't be, you know, too fun. I have to be at work at 10 in the morning. Yes, I'm working on my birthday. So let's pull in here. So I just car's gone through hell. This Maverick, I tell you, right now the odometer on this thing is 90,952.5. King's is closed right now. I'm going to pull up right in front. wonder if he's out there. There he is. Here, here he is. Ah, ah. Well, Joe, I thought this was going to be chronicle. Now, Joe, are there any words of wisdom you can give me on this wild night we're about to have? Well, Tom, I just got to say that uh, I like the name, actually. Uh, <laughs> Yes, and I think it's going to be a good night. Uh, we're going to get wild, crazy. Yes, that sort of thing. That sort of thing. Good, and I also have my camera ready, and... Okay, you're in the sky's way. Look out! Oh, my God! Oh, Sorry about that. Okay, so where, which way are we going? Okay, uh... East. No, okay. <laughs> 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 Said that today. How's my love? Oh, you have an empty home. That's your right. Yeah, yeah, now, this is about 10, I don't know what, it's probably about quarter of 11 now, and Joe is trying to find out how to use my. Turn the light on. No, you, you, let me show you. You, you slide this across. All right, like that. And now make sure the battery's on. And up here, you, you do this. Now wait till the green light comes on. And by golly, you hit that picture. Green light. Where is it? It's coming. Green light. Green light. In the back. Where you hit the button. You didn't get a picture of me, did you? Yes, I did. What Joe, what, what exactly do you have to, um, do you think this, this, this night will yield for me? Well, I On the, e know, the eve of my 20th birthday, I mean. If we can't have a good time, then I'll just go and beat your head against the wall. Or well, let's, let's see if we hit the back. Ah. Yes, we made a break and the car died. Let's oh. see what happens. And oh my! See if we can oh, let's start to have some fun. We have fun! We have fun! Oh my God! It died, oh, Joe. This isn't funny. This isn't funny. Damn it! It died. Now. Okay, you know, it's in. It's in neutral. I'll push it. Which way? That way to the right? Just get to the side, yeah? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is our... I can't see! You're gonna have to help me! Correct me! Well, this is very fun. We're pulling back. We're almost there. We're going past the sign. We're... Now, Joe, we're, we're faced with the uh, almost dead battery, and we're here in Roselle it Park. It is a dead battery, Tom. Well, it's, it's close. Dead as hell. Ooh, and we have, ooh, wow. Water is shielding everywhere. I don't know. <laughs> Boy, it's foam. Well, at least we know the, at least we know the, uh, the radiator is okay. All right, I got Tom here. Very weird for recording this whole thing. What do you think? But, uh, all right, anyway. Happy birthday. This is, um, we're here on, uh, well, this, I don't think it's South, yeah, it is still South Avenue, I think. Oh, we're going into this Welsh Farms. We're walking up here to the, uh, the phone booth, and where Joe's calling up Shelly. Yes, I'd like to know the number for the Dunkin' Donuts in Elizabeth. Dunkin' Donuts in Elizabeth. See that Dunkin' Donuts? 
Alright, uh... What? What? Did you put money in for uh, information? Uh, Broadway. Did you put money in for information? 351-0199. Okay. Yes, it made me pay for the damn information call. You know, I'm gonna... Oh. Okay, we're calling up Dunkin' Donuts. She's at Dunkin' Donuts. Yes. She lives there? No, she doesn't live there. She's eating donuts or something. <laughs> well, Damn it, somebody's on the phone. Busy? Yeah. Well, so we have some time to ourselves here. <laughs> yeah, we're calling a taxi service in Roselle. Yes, uh, I'm at the corner of uh, Amsterdam, Amsterdam Avenue. Amsterdam Avenue. And First Ave. And East First Ave. Well, just First Ave in Roselle. I want to go to Cranford. Uh, we're in Cranford, we want to go. Um, Casino Street. Casino Avenue. Casino Avenue. Off of Riverside Drive. Off of Riverside Drive. I don't think so. Okay, thank you very much. You get the front seat. <laughs> you get the front seat. Eight dollars. Yes. You can only go for two blocks. And while we're waiting for the cab, Joe's going to give us a little waiting for the cab music here. Yeah. This song is called My Car Won't Start in Roselle Blues. Thank you. Take it away, Joe. Here it is. Not quite my birthday, but hey. It all started when I got the car back in May of 86. Boy, what a time. I'm not going to sing, Joe, if that's what you think. Just keep talking. Well, and you see, and I crashed into a ditch in June of 86. And then it got stuck in the Holland Tunnel in July of 86. And then, well, it almost died in 87. And then it, it, people tried to junk it when I was in high school. And then, oh, God. And then and I was pulled over by the cops all the time. I, I took it down to KMA in August of 87. And then in February of 88, I hit a curb on my birthday. And here we are in February of 89. And hey, it had installed at the corner of Amsterdam Ave and first in Roosevelt Farm. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. So this is a, I mean, I feel like we're in New York right now, Joe, and you know, like we're maybe smoking some weed. I sit, need some weed. Sit, uh, sit <laughs> on the corner and uh, and so Joe and Tom sat and talked on the curb for a long, long time until the taxi came and took them back to Cranford and to English Village, where Joe's mother said, You can have my car, but don't go fast. Soon Joe and Tom were off once again heading to Elizabeth. There, on Rawway Avenue, they found Shelley who had been sitting on a stool, eating donuts since noon. Then at last the three sped away, listening to logic downwards, looking for a place where a teenager could drink and not be afraid. And now, the rest of our story. <laughs> Hey, <coughs> it's about ten after one now, and we're um. Well, we had a few drinks. Well, we had a few. No. <laughs> we had a few drinks. <laughs> we're well, smoking uh, just a few drinks. <laughs> Didn't really overdo it, too. <laughs> Okay, now we're headed off to another bar to drink even what? more. No. Oh, whatever. Well, we're in Elizabeth now. <laughs> <laughs> we've been, <laughs> well, we've been in Elizabeth for like an hour now. Uh, well, now here we are. Where are we, where are we now? Helicky's, right? Helicky's, okay. Uh, yes, sorry, Blue It's yes, okay, it's two minutes later. Well, they weren't carding, but, you know, it's a three dollar cover charge. <laughs> and I wasn't going to go in anyway, you know. Ah, uh, Bruce Wayne. I mean, right now I'm enjoying a panorama view of, like, uh, refineries and lights everywhere. It's really kind of psychedelic. But then again, the same could be said about the Holland Tunnel, right, Joe? <laughs> Right? I mean, uh, so really, so how do you feel about the tunnel? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking knockout, punk, 
So we're heading off to another bar. All right, let's let's see how this one turns out. Oh, we're back. <laughs> it's about three o'clock. It's very cold. We just spent the past hour and a half. Not so. Well, I wasn't getting scared. I was just this, this guy is going nuts. This guy, he was like, this guy's on something. I said, yeah, napalm. <laughs> there's a dime sitting on the edge of a shot glass, and you have and it's, and it's all over on the dollar bill. And the guy was like, you have to get it off without touching the, you know, anything. I got it off. I pushed it off by just putting my hands under the dollar and pushing it off. And he was like, no, well, I'll show you how you do it. <laughs> well, it's about quarter after three now, twenty after three, and we just eaten at Dunkin' Donuts. And, well, Joe, I must say, ooh, <laughs> well, we had a real bad night. I don't know. It's, Crazy night. I'm still not. I, I'm still not 20, Joe. It's still not my birthday, really. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. Ready? Ready? One, two, three. Da 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 he can put his right hand, his right, his left hip pocket, and make an omelet on his head. No man can do that. We're talking about pizza coli. Oh, and that he could. <laughs> <laughs> Jill, Jill, I'm home. Oh, good, fine. Jill, Jill, I'm home. And for you. More confidential bank stuff? Bingo. Great, let's okay. have more confidential bank stuff? Bingo. Your brother, uh -huh. we're close friends in college. I'm dense today. What does that mean? Well, we're close friends in college. I'm dense today. What does that mean? <laughs> and now we now take you to the starting of Tom's car. Here on February 12, 1989. And the moment of truth. Okay, it started. What, what's your final analysis on this night, Joe? Well, uh, it's been a good night. Yes, I agree with that. You haven't, uh... Killed anybody, or... Um, well, that's true. Yes. It's always disappointing, but... <laughs> but, anyway, it's, it's gotten a lot colder out here, Tom. Uh, uh, well, and also... Oh, and also, uh... Yeah, you know, what could you say? Oh, uh, you know, it's... I just gotta say, you know... Goddamn impossible way of life. Thank you, Joe. Now get back in your car and let's go home. Well, it's the end of my 20th birthday, even though I'm not 20 yet, so... Well, I'm going to drive home now. We'll see ya. Goodbye.